Okay, hey, Captain Lee Chrysler here, Ocean Breeze Charters. I'm going to be cooking some yellowfin tuna today, and one of my favorite recipes with Asian chili oil, and we're going to be using a Montreal seasoning, and I'm going to show you how to make this. We're going to blacken this today and make fish tacos out of it. Uh, for those who don't know anything about the yellowfin tuna, it is a very, very clean meat, not fishy. It tastes more like beef than anything. This is a nice, nice, what we call tuna steak right here. Very nice cut of meat. We caught this out in the Gulf of Mexico about 135 miles offshore out of Galveston, Texas. So anyways, let's get started. I already had sliced up. I took one of my steaks that I've got cubed up already and I went ahead and sliced up the steaks into smaller, thinner pieces. And the reason I did them thin is because my family doesn't like them medium rare. So the thinner you make them, the more they cook. But do not cook tuna dry. You cannot overcook tuna. A minute and a half on each side. If you, if you overcook it, it'll turn out to be flaky and dry in your mouth and it'll be like chewing on a piece of bubble gum. Anyways, I'm going to start out right now with the uh, chili oil sauce, as you can see right here. This chili oil sauce is really, it looks like it's hot, but actually it's not. We're down here in Texas, so we like everything a little spicy. So this is what I choose for it. So I'm going to dab a little on top of it. And then we're going to kind of rub it all in and make it almost like a marinade on it so don't worry about the heat it's not that bad at all this fire roasted chili is not hot a little bit warm so i call it uh hot gringo warm instead of mexican warm so anyways just mix it up real good get the oil on it because the oil is going to help sear it so you'll sear this uh, tuna nice, and then you can uh, make your tacos out of it. So, okay, that's prepped right there. Next thing I'm gonna do is put the Montreal seasoning on it. Wash that oil off. So I'm gonna sprinkle this Montreal seasoning. It's gonna take just like a steak, like you're eating fajitas that are spiced up. So good, my favorite thing. To cook on the boat after we come in so we've got a big sport fishing boat so I um, I like to cook down in the galley our fresh catch and uh, this is one of my favorite meals to make that's not um, it's healthy and it's not you don't feel bloated or, or full on it so anyways let's uh, mix that up you Real mean good. it's healthy yeah oh, yeah very healthy and it doesn't make you uh, bloated. So I'm gonna mix that up real good. I'm gonna put a little seasoning on here. So th this seasoning has salt in it, so put whatever you think you're good with, so don't over salt in it. Just gonna mix that up real good. And then we got a black cast iron skillet with a little bit of olive oil in it. So 